Hello everyone. So, uh, this is my very first um, live streaming. So, I'm very, very excited everyone. So, here you can see all the materials uh, needed to, to paint this. And today I'm going to paint um, something like um, um, a barn or a, a mountain hut. So, if you are with me, you can also follow and, and just enjoy. Actually, I am very nervous now because this is my very first time. Okay, so the same materials everyone I'm using now and always uh, uh, you can also put your comments uh, on, the li on, the, on the live chat. You can ask me anything. I can, I can read your, uh, your, your, your chat there and I will just tell you live uh, my answer. Okay. So here uh, you see uh, I am going to I am going to I am going to use uh, this uh, reference photo from the Pixabay. So I'm going to use to paint this uh, mountain hat now, and I will be using the same materials. So I will be using the uh, as you can see here the same materials that I'm, I'm using before. Okay, so I'm going to start now, and I'm going to start with the sketching. You can, you can, you can actually comment, everyone. You can, you can put your um, chat. Or you can put your comments on the live chat, and I can answer you anything. Okay, so I'm going to start. It's been three minutes. So I have here the row umber. So I'm going to sketch first uh, the hat. Uh, I'm going I'm going to change the the, uh, the mountains everyone. I'm going to make it a little darker because on my reference um, it's so still so dark something like that. Uh, it's too light. I mean uh, I need to put uh, maybe a sky there. I need to put sky. I need to put maybe an afternoon something like that. So here. So actually everyone, uh, making live video is uh, much more, uh, I feel so nervous <laughs> while doing this compared to the offline tutorial. So this is my very first time. I hope the connection is good. We can use the live chat everyone if you are going to uh, ask anything there or something uh, to me, something like that. Okay. So we're gonna sketch first. I think this will take a lot of time. So this will be the the top or the roof part. And also this one. Um, I get this photo from the Pixabay, uh, so it doesn't have to be. I'm not. We are not afraid to we're not afraid to I'm not afraid that this is uh, this will be uh, this have a copyright so uh, it's good that uh, if you want to have a reference photo so you can you can use the pixabay or pixels uh, I'm not uh, they are not sponsoring me but uh, their photos are 
are free. It's already free. So you don't have to worry about those copyrights. But uh, if you can uh, take your own photo, that's better. That's much better compared to compared to compared to uh, downloading from the internet. It's also very dangerous. So I'm gonna put the tree here. Yeah. Can move a little maybe yeah I think I will move a little here I am using a small uh, canvas and also the mountains we do not need to copy everything there uh, what you see just uh, you can make it as your reference or, or as your guide so it's very important everyone make it as your guide only okay Maybe I'm going to move this one a little bit. Uh, I'm not really sure if my connection is good now, but I'm just hoping that uh, my connection is good so that uh, my live, live streaming will be, uh, will be continue in, in good condition or something like that. There's no interruption. Okay. Okay, you can you can put your you can put anything in the chat everyone. So here the mountains there so I am done now with the sketching so it takes a lot of time uh, for me because uh, I think uh, I feel a little nervous okay so I'm going to fill everything here with dark colors first because I want to let it dry first before because uh, it's very uh, not good if I'm going to do first the sky and this one part will be wet and I should have to do this one first so let's do first the uh, this uh, uh, the hut or the barn. What do you, I don't know what uh, the exact term for this one, but I think it's a hut. That's what I've searched. It is they say that it's a hut or a mountain hut, something like that. In my country, also we call it a nipa hut. But it's so much different um, house design than this one. So I will fill everything here with the uh, blue umber, so that it uh, when it dry, we can uh, we can fill it up later on. Okay. there so I have now the underpainting so this is the second step everyone the first step is the sketching and the second step is the underpainting okay and then I'm going to try to add the sky I'm going to clean my brush first first I have here the blue and the white with a little red to make it purple so I'm gonna make it light
there. I want to make it light. I'm gonna add some white. You can clean your brush everyone if you want. If you don't want that anything there, it will be... Okay, so wait, I'm gonna check my phone. I don't know if someone will... Uh, sending some chat. Okay. So this uh, that will be the first step. With everyone, I'm going to see. Yeah. Does it feel like? Sorry, bro. Oh, sorry, bro. So I didn't see your chat. Uh, I am here. Yeah. So thank you for your chat. Actually, I don't know why I cannot see on my on my computer, but uh, on my phone I can see everything. Your chat. So it's here. <laughs> I don't know why I can why I cannot see. Uh, okay, so Leon Persinger. Uh, hi, Chris Canvas Art. Hello, thank you for watching. Uh, Silly Shorts. Hello, uh, Patrick o Ode. Hello, welcome here. It's my first time. I'm sorry if uh, I feel actually a little nervous. April Tobin, thank uh, hello. Okay, so there's a problem in my computer. Uh, sorry, my phone. I uh, my my camera just turned off. Um. Wait, everyone, I'm going to make sure that everything is perfect. Okay, yeah, I'm back again. Okay, so I'm going to greet you, everyone. Uh, Barinder Randawa, Ranhawa, hello. <laughs> uh, Russian Cherry, hello. Barinder Randawa again. So, Safa Q. Hello, uh, thank you for being here for watching. Okay, so sorry everyone, I didn't see your messages because I'm using my computer. I'm watching it here, but I didn't think that uh, nothing was showing here. So here I'm going to continue again. I'm going to mix red with yellow or uh, with white to make it uh, pink. There. So it's kind of messy, uh, as you can see here. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to add I'm gonna make the sky a little pinkish, everyone, or uh, light purple or something like that. I want it to be on an afternoon landscape, like but I will try to make it as detailed as possible. Maybe, yeah, it will take it will it will take a lot of time. Hello, Timothy. Uh, yeah, E two is art. Hello. Sorry, everyone. I don't draw uh, something like that. Okay, so I'm going to fill it everything here with a with a blowish stone, something like that. So I'm going to uh, put first the underpainting in the sky. Uh, I think it must be better.
And my canvas, everyone, uh, I bought it a uh, cheap canvas and I added uh, another layer of um, queso to make it uh, better. Uh, to make it smooth, something like that. Yeah, it's, it's very hot here. <laughs> I need to drink some water. Okay, so I'm going to mix uh, some purple. And then white. Okay, so here everyone, uh, I'm gonna make this part a little <clears throat> uh, bluish, and then this part would be some greenish, uh, the mountain will be nearer to us. <clears throat> okay, so I'll mix for uh, purple. So usually I'm, I'm using this for the underpainting. Hello, Rakshana, Rakshana Perwin. Thank you for watching. Attention. Actually, I'm using the same uh, the same colors, the same the, the same sets of colors. So I'm still using the five limited colors here. So attention, um, I'm using uh, five limited colors, which are the uh, raw umber, titanium white, something like that, and what they call this, uh, medium yellow, brilliant red, um, talo blue, so those are the common colors that I am using, so yeah, so we are still in the underpainting everyone, it is, it, is, it is 20 minutes now, I am very very slow when it comes to life, actually, yeah, this is my first time. And I'm a bit nervous. Hello, everyone. Uh, hello, artistic cat. Welcome here to my first live chat, a uh, live streaming. I really don't know what uh, will come out of my painting. So here, I will try to use some um, yellow, just yellow, because. Uh, there hello victorious welcome here mariana russo hello from romania welcome here welcome to my first live stream okay so i have here again uh not again <laughs> it's my first time using this uh yellow and the red I'm going to put some orange here because I think the the uh, the grassland or the grasses turns a little orange. So I'm gonna put some something like that here. Hello, Silla Shorts, Sonia Kisi. Hello, Saf Kyo. Hello, Muhammad Furman. Hi. Manisha Bulanti, hello. Crawford, please. Thank you. You are also my. Uh, thank you for making me as an inspiration. But uh, I think you are you are also good in art. A ship ace uh, s. How does it get better than that? 
Okay. Uh, don't worry about that. Uh, we are still in the underpainting. So, uh, you can see later the progress here. So, you can see here, it's uh, very, very messy. Look like even an abstract. So, yeah, don't worry about that. It will turn good later on. Uh, hello, Manisha. Thank you for making my paintings uh, of my of my work or for my tutorial. The ship is uh, yeah. Pindu V. Hi, hello, silly shorts. Yeah, sweet uh, juicy. Hello, thank you for coming. Okay, so I will get now much serious about this part because I'm gonna start adding the on the painting. Okay, I'm gonna start adding the the details now. Hello, Angie Nevares from Los Angeles. Welcome to my first live stream. Uh, Crawford, please. Hello. Uh, hello, welcome. Nafcraft, Tasi. Hello. Angie Nevares, uh, thank you so much. Thank you. Uh, ODD Lamine, where are from? I am from. Uh, I am from the Philippines okay and then I'm going to start uh, a little uh, details now so I have here I'm adding white to the orange I'm going to make this uh, a little I'm going to make this like an afternoon something so I'm adding a little yellowish color here and also here. There. And also here, yeah. A little orange everyone. This will make like an afternoon or something like that. I want it to be like an afternoon landscape. So I have a little red here, one white. Okay, uh, Pabol Horban, hello. Okay. This is my very first live stream. <laughs> I don't know what, uh, what uh, would come out on my painting now, but uh, I'm actually very, very excited. <laughs> Safa Q, hello. Hello, Tenshin. Thank you very much. Uh, actually, it's not the easiest, but I'm trying my best to to show you um, my way or how I paint also. So, it's been 25 minutes now, and I'm still in this part. <laughs> I think I'm very, very slow using live stream. Okay, so here I will try to put a little light blue color. So I will start now doing some miracles <laughs> on my work. So here I'll try to do some light blue. So this part will be the sky everyone. Uh, usually you can see the light blue sky in the afternoon like this. Okay, now I'm going to mix for purple, light purple to mix up. I have here the red, the blue, and the white. And then here we can put some some clouds. So yeah, but uh, I will not put. Uh, any lights here everyone because I think this is a very dry or uh, flat day or something like that I don't know what uh, how to explain this that, uh, this one 
but the color is so flat I'm going to make a pink color hello Muhammad Firman hello Asi Sul Ali yeah I add water if uh, if it's hard for me to uh, uh, if it's hard to drag uh, my the, the brush into the canvas so I need to add a little water or the paint is so dry so I need to add water also so water for me is really needed here I cannot uh, water is uh, really if you want to make your painting smooth you need a lot of water or a good amount of water yeah this is my sky here and also here I can put uh, this will be uh, not a sunny day everyone so I'll make it uh, since I changed the sky I will make it a little dark compared to the original photo so just to like that I don't want to copy everything there I want to change something okay now I'm going to put hello Pabol Horban Ari Arya Manikpuri from Artist Hello. Thank you for being here. So I'm going to uh, use some purple. Yeah. Again. Or much more, much more bluish color. Right, I'm going to put some white. And I will start with the mountain now. As you can see, the mountain is so pale, uh, bluish tone or something like that. I'm going to make a little brighter here on the bottom part okay and then also here the next mountain but it should be also darker So I have to cover some parts of the sky, everyone. There. And then on the far part, you can see also on here in the top some parts of the mountain yeah I'll just cover it here hello Rita Lock. Uh welcome here uh, I cannot understand your word I, think, I don't know what's your language but welcome here thank you for watching hello Tiep Don Don E to S Art. Hello, Muhammad Ferman. Hello, thank you for subscribing me. It was July 17, 2015. That's, that was a very long time ago. Thank you for being here always. Okay, so, oh yeah, my guinea pig now is crying. Yeah, here I'm going to make this part a little darker on the back part. But still, it looks misty because I'm using a light colors. Okay, and then I'm gonna use this uh, light purple. Yeah, still uh, the same color, everyone. So I'm going to put also the mountains on the back. Yeah, there's some mountain range there. 
I really don't know uh, because it's too bright everyone I think the camera uh, when he took this photo it's so I think this it's, it's a very bright day and I think it's uh, over overexposed on the part of the sky so I cannot see any blue in the sky there um, I need to create my own sky hello Kerry Groves thank you thank you for following me Uh, tip then hello crazy art come uh, crazy canvas art uh, the question is uh, do you like also yeah uh, oil paint oil paint is my favorite uh, medium actually it's my favorite uh, for me uh, oil paint uh, is uh, it's uh, I like it much uh, better than the acrylics, but for this channel, I always use the acrylic. But all this much more uh, uh, for me, uh, especially in the blending part, I can blend better in the ac in the oils. And when I when I paint uh, portraits, I I usually use oils. Um, when someone commissioned me to do to do it, I I prefer oil than acrylics. So thank you for your question. <laughs> Artiska, I wish you a technique to make paintings. Thank you. Artiska, thank you. Artistica, thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, I'm not yet. Uh, I'm still very, very far from the truth. Actually, uh, I'm very pressured to do this, <laughs> to do the first live stream. Okay, so, yeah, I have now the, this, uh, the under underpainting of the, of the, of the what they call this of the mountains so i need to put now some details there uh the the what they call this the, the snow yeah so i need to do it but uh, i need to use a smaller brush i have here the number two non flat brush it's a small flat brush hello tin chain which you like the most oil or acrylic i like the most uh i think it's oil it's my favorite medium compared to acrylics so i like it better than acrylics yeah but uh, in this channel i use acrylic because uh, it dry fast it dries very fast and it's easier for me to to paint uh, faster with the if i paint landscape i can finish faster so everyone i'll try to put something like um, snow I'll start now putting some snow. I am using now uh, the very small flat brush. It's a number two nine flat brush. Um, it's a uh, smallest flat brush I have, but you can use uh, bigger than this one. Maybe number three, one. It's uh, good. It's just fine. Yeah, I'm trying to put now some snow. Uh, I'll just follow the pattern, but I will not copy everything there what I saw because uh, it will take a lot of time actually I don't know everyone maybe I'll finish this for two hours. I don't know <laughs> uh, There Hello big car Radha Art Creation, thank you so much. Hello, Vincent Shai. Uh, hello, thank you for being here. Thousand miles. Hello, nakabutin. Salamat, maraming salamat. Thousand miles. <laughs> uh, Filipino, thank you. Bika Kulao, yeah, you can. Uh, pwede ka rin mag painting. Pwede, pwede mag gayahin. Okay. So, yeah, I'm good. <laughs> Actually, it's very fun, everyone, while reading your comments, while reading your uh, chats. Uh, I feel, uh, I feel also um, energized, something like that. I don't feel alone here. Okay, so I'm going to start now adding uh, tiny details on the mountain. So I'm, uh, I am using a little lighter uh, purple. So I have to create uh details here like that it's just an optical illusion everyone 
you can just create similar effects as what you see on the on the on the photo and then apply it there and yeah you can just surprise uh, the result so here yeah I'll try to put some, I think this is a rocky mountain everyone. Maybe later I'm going to put a light here that hit on this mountain, but maybe later. I want to make this mountain uh, special. Uh, I want it to be different than the mountains that we are, we are watching on our reference. So I want to be different, yeah. Uh, make sure everyone that, uh, that uh, light uh, highlights is not, uh, so much bright something like that there i really don't know where uh, the light located on this on this photo everyone this is my problem now i don't know where the the real sun actually uh, this is a very uh, flat uh, picture there's no light here i think it's an afternoon Radha art creation. Yeah, I, I actually I have uh, a lot of mountain um, tutorials on my on my on my channel, but you can also check check it out. Actually, mountains uh, is very challenging, especially if you are beginners. But it's not that hard. But later on, I'm going to add light here because I think for me this is so uh, dull, something like that. There's no light at all. So I need to change a little bit here. Okay, so. Colorful ink pot, uh, thank you, uh, from Kerala. Into a Nafi, <laughs> I don't understand. Artist Cat, thank you for being here. And uh, yeah, thank you for watching and goodbye. <laughs> okay. So I don't know uh, how this will turn out, everyone. But uh, I will spend a lot of time for this. Yeah, maybe two hours or three hours. I don't know. But it's fun to to do it also like that. And then this one also. I will make some details. I will make. I will put some uh, snow there. So we just have to do it a little slowly like this. So we're gonna do it a little slowly and carefully using a small brush. I'm going to add now a little light. Okay, everyone, so I need to 
change a bit the colors because I think it's too bright, uh, too much uh, colors there. So I need to adjust. Yeah, I think that will be better. Okay, so I think the color is too much there. So I need to adjust a little bit. So I'm going to continue adding the mountains. Hello Carmen from Brazil. Good afternoon to you. Uh, Dennis Jangan, can you give some tips for for portrait painting? Yeah, uh, portrait painting is uh, you just have to copy it from the from your reference. Uh, it's kind of complicated and hard compared to 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 landscape painting. But uh, the difference that um, in in portrait you need to get the likeness. Of the photo, or if you someone will have a commission to you, uh, you, you need to get the likeness. Uh, that's why it's very pressure to create a portrait, especially if it's from a real person. But it's also, also fun and good learning experience. You can use um, if ever it's hard for you to draw manually, you can use. Uh, I think you can use. Uh, grading technique or graphing technique to to create uh, or to to draw the uh, the likeness something like that. King Sok does hi sir I'm big fan of your works I follow many of your drawings I leave your work and keep doing. Uh, thank you very much King Sok King Sok does thank you for also being here. Teresa Brooks hello uh, thank you for being here. Radha Art Creation from India Art Channel Center. Thank you, Radha Art Creations. Thank you, Piki Parwan, for watching my video. Uh, actually, I'm very sorry, everyone, if I am a little slow now. <laughs> yeah, I really don't know. Uh, it's so much different than, than painting it uh, not live. So much different, so much pressure here. So here I am trying to make the mountains uh, realistic now. So to make it much looking like a snowy mountain. Just have to do it uh, slowly to create those uh, to, the, to create those uh, snows. Uh, I will link the photo everyone if you want to see and also to the to the owner of the photo so I want to say thank you uh, Colorful Impact, thank you for being here Teresa Brooks, I love to watch you paint they, they are always busy, thank you Teresa Brooks thank you for, for having here thank you for, thank you for watching my video okay so I think that will be good for the mountain and I will try to create here everyone maybe I will try to make this uh, bright here because uh, for me this is so flat I need to make something for this mountain yeah uh, I don't really like it <laughs> so I'm going to mix for the yellow and the raw umber and then red It's actually a light brown now and I wanted to create something that looks like uh, it's been hit by the lights there so I assume that the lights coming from the left side uh, from the right side yeah because actually there are no lights here it's uh, the reference of photo is so flat I need to do something uh, to make it uh, most exciting sometimes you need to to change something on the photo if you want to to make it a uh, better. Actually, the photo is good. 
Our friends is good. Hello, Mayor. Oh, Ozu no glue. Hello. Thank you. Thank you for being here. And also this one. I'm gonna try to uh, put some co some lights here. There. So at least you can see some lights now on the mountains. So I think this mountain, everyone, is a rocky mountain. And also here. Yeah, I need to do something here, everyone, because uh, for me it's too flat. I need to create something there that it will stand out. So by using this small brush, uh, number two, uh, slowly adding some lights, you can create those beautiful mountains with lights now. So do not overdo it also. Uh, I want to put something also like a light there or the snows. There, so at least you can see that uh, it's hit by the lights. Okay, so I think the mountain now is uh, better. Okay. Yeah, so I think uh, it's much more different now. Uh, but uh, the idea is still the same. Yeah, it's been 49 minutes now, everyone. And I'm still on this part. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to now start adding some more details here but uh, i think i will try to create more on the on the sky so yeah thank you chrissy uh, chrissy canvas art uh, for being here thank you for watching i think uh, it will take me a lot of time finishing this one i've been uh, painting this for 15 minutes now and I'm not yet, I'm still far. So here I have the uh, orange. And then white. So I'm going to put some Highlights here, yeah. Uh, a little pinkies or reddish. There, also here. I want to. Let you see that uh, this has been hit by the lights on this part. There, and then on the on the back part, I need to. Hello, Rosalie Benedicto Shildon. Uh, welcome here. Uh, Kasini, salamat, maraming salamat. And I'm going to put some light also here in the back. There, at least uh, this part a little brighter. 
Okay. Yeah, I think the mountain looks good now. Uh, colorful Ingpa, thank you very much. Muhammad Furman, thank you for always being here. Hello, Chrissy Canvas Art. Uh, goodbye. Thank you for being here. Tinshin Amdul. Uh, the canvas is just to, uh, 12 by 10. It's very, very small canvas. Okay, I'm, I'll try to zoom in so that we can see clearly. Uh, yeah. I'll try not to zoom in, everyone. Okay, so I hope you can still see. Okay, so I will be focusing now on that part. Yeah, I need to move a little bit. Okay, I need to move a little bit. Wait, I need to move a little bit. Wait, uh, okay. So I will now put the the forest there. So I hope you can can see clearly. First, I want to put some dark colors or dark uh, background for the forest. Uh, is it tall? Do you wet the canvas before painting? Um, no, but uh, I added uh, one layer of uh, gesso before painting this one, so it's much more soft now. Uh, A2 is art. Thank you for being here. Goodbye. Nana in our art. Hello. Thank you for being here. Okay. So I'm going to. Uh, I have here. I am now using uh, this number 8 nylon flat brush. It's a smaller flat brush. So. Green, blue, and the red. I'm going to add more blue and the red. So it's look like a dark green here. But I'm going to add some white and more yellow. Yeah, I need to add some more yellow. And in here, everyone. Yeah, it looks more like uh, I'm gonna put through umber. Yeah, I want it to look dark here. And then I think I'm gonna add some blue yeah, and the red. It's really hard to get this kind of color now. Yeah, this is good. So I am on the on the far using this uh, brush, the number eight and the brush. Okay, something wrong with my. I don't know. I think the connection is. Yeah. Fairless ma uh, MT gamer, thank you very much. Uh, thank you for for your comment. Uh, Nihar said, hey, thank you very much. So, Mike say thank you. So I am adding here a little dark green. So everything here will be a little dark green, but not so dark everyone. It should be like uh, lighter also. And also in the far everyone it should be much more uh, greenish so I'm, I'm using this blue green everyone Then 
there and then much more bluish blue and the red yeah and then white Yeah, here I will put uh, some mountain also here, but this time it will be much more bluish. I want got a motorcycle here, <laughs> and also a little mountain here. Hello, I'm me, Art and Craft. Uh, thank you. Salamat, maraming salamat po dito. It's Gilman. Hi, Jim. What's the best acrylic paint brand based on your experience? Actually, uh, I'm using a uh, limited, uh, I mean, sorry, uh, I'm using student grade acry acrylics. So, these acrylics, everyone, are, uh, if you compare this to the uh, artist grade, uh, it's just nothing. But uh, in my experience, I like the PBO opaque and I like the Sakura opaque uh, acrylics. So, they have uh, better colors because they're opaque and it's good um, you can you can use the ye yellow and the red and blue better than other colors because some are really transparent it's hard to to put uh, to to cover it with other colors or if you if you're painting like this landscape and you need really opaque colors so uh, for me it's a uh, uh, PBO and PBO and and I don't know if you can find other brands also good you can also use, uh, comment uh, below but I don't know I did ever try other brands so here I'm going to mix some greens yeah I'm going to put it on the far part here it's a light green everyone I'm adding some white so on this part uh, you can see some greenish color uh, hit by the lights on these uh, trees so actually these are very far trees but you can use a smaller brush there okay so yeah that's fine doesn't have to be very very clear let me add some white there okay you can see now a little colors there in the far maraming salamat Rosely Benedicto Sheldon hello I'm me art and craft thank you very much for being here okay yeah I'm actually a little tired now It's now, I think it's 1 a.m. <laughs> okay, so here I will try to put another lights. Light green everyone in the far. This is also a forest. But I'll just put a little light greens there. Okay, and that looks good. Okay, at least you can see there some, it looks like uh, trees. And now on this part of the trees, uh, I see there that it's, it's brownish. Yeah, it's a, uh, it's a, uh, like, uh, like an autumn, I don't know what you call this one. I've never been in the other countries. So I never see autumn, I never see uh, fall. So the trees there are brownish. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to use yellow and the red. And then white and with a little greens. So to create those brown everyone. I'm using a small brush again because it's hard to use a bristle flat brush 
kaya my surface is small, the canvas is very very small. So we're gonna use a uh, uh, different brush or smaller brush. So here I will try to add some lights. There, so you can use the tapping technique just like that. Just a little part. There. Okay, so here. Yeah, you can you can create those uh, trees, everyone. But uh, you need to do it little by little. That's why I'm using a very small brush. Hello, Rick Ha Bum Bamani Bume. I don't know what how to pronounce your name. So, your painting are absolutely beautiful. Thank you, thank you so much for your comment uh, for your chat. Singling the maze full here is many oranges and yellows and red. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. I never been in other countries, so I never saw fall in real, uh, in 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 person. So maybe later on, I hope so. I hope that uh, COVID nineteen will go away and everything will back into normal. We just have to pray. Okay, so I am now doing a uh, tapping technique. I'm not sure if you can see it clearly everyone but I want you to see this part how I'm doing this so I'm going to zoom in so that you can see clearly yeah, I hope you can see clearly there okay so I want you to see that part I move a little bit, yeah. So, yeah, so you can see it clearly there. Craftboard, please. Uh, yeah, I will try to do more live. Um, Hits Gilman, please do more. It is like this. You are an amazing artist. Yeah, I will try. I will try more. I never done uh, acrylic. I've used oil, it's acrylic easier. I know it is dries fast. Actually, it is it's up to you. Uh, still, my favorite medium is oil, but acrylic uh, dries really, really fast. I can paint um, a, a landscape faster than oils. Because for me, I don't like, I don't really, I'm not a fan of wet and wet. When I use oil paints, I let it dry for the first layer, and then after one day, I try to finish it. And and yeah, I can. Uh, what I like about oil paint is that uh, it does, I can blend better. If you can see uh, my works and in oils, you can visit my uh, my my website. You can see some of my oil paint uh, uh, oil uh, paintings there. So yeah. So here I'm, I'm going to do it a little slowly so that you can, yeah, it's a bit, uh, you need to have a lot of patience doing this one everyone. I'm using a little orange or yellowish uh, color for the leaves. It looks dried or something like that, it looks fall or autumn. So I, I, I need to do it a little slowly, something like that. use your fingers to 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 clean up some parts yeah 
Yeah, you can use your fingers to clean up. I'm going to make sure a little reddish color. I'm going to put some red. Some parts a little reddish. Uh, Ginebe Barosote, hello po, watching you sir. Maraming salamat for watching from Bahrain. Simula na po nood ko mga paintings ng China rin ako. So, maraming salamat Ginebe Barosote. Siglin Mace, Siglin de Mace. I don't know how, so I'm sorry sir. I really cannot pronounce your name good. Uh, I've been done, actually, uh, yeah, I was with this one. In my art and craft, I don't know brand ng brush na gamit mo. Actually, napaka cheap lang ng brush ko. Uh, I bought this in the in the old paint store. <laughs> yeah, you can find it at uh, Tops brand brushes. Juliet Zanata Cardoso, hi from Brazil. Siglin T. Mays, do you sell your paintings? Yeah, I actually sell my paintings, sir. Um, but uh, I want to create. Uh, not for the tutorial. I want to, I want to create uh, actually my real works. <laughs> I, uh, I don't know why, but uh, in my tutorial, I feel that uh, I am rushing everything <laughs> because of time. The better. Um, if I finish it faster, the better. Because of uh, no one will watch if it's too long. <laughs> Thing like that but uh, on my re real works I spend too much time maybe days to finish a work so I think I like it better to sell like this work uh, actually it's bigger in size also uh, Don Roms hi Sir John super fun mo ko watching from Saudi Arabia may mga ginaya pa kong paintings maraming salamat Don Roms from Saudi Arabia thank you for watching Thank you for following my works also. Uh, just keep practice, keep, keep painting. So here I'm going to add some uh, reddish. This time now everyone is a little brownish or reddish tone. It's different from the first tone that I, I put. Okay, so I have here. So everyone, if uh, it takes a lot of time for this one, I just want to spend more time on this painting. Actually, I don't know, maybe it will take me two hours for this one. Usually, maybe I'll just take this for uh, one hour, if I'm gonna do it a little more faster. But uh, a bit nervous when I first start this one. <laughs> so, I don't know, uh, I'll just try my best. So here also, I'll put some colors. Okay, and now I will do the other one. I'm gonna use this raw umber with a little blue. Yeah, I'm gonna put it here. Mm, more red, I think. It's uh, more brownish. Uh, the near three blue one is much more brownish, so I'm gonna use this color. I hope you can see it clearly there. this is a big tree third group super inspired po ako sa mga paintings mo first time nanonood ng painting kung napaisip ko kung nagtry ng ganoon dami ko na painting salamat Don Roms salamat sa comment mo salamat din sa panonood at salamat sa pag ah Pag try ng mga gawa ko. Akbar Ali Ahmed, Juliet, do you have isang gawa nga? Okay. Um, big girl fan, BD na air. Thank you so much. Vamos Falard, so big. Okay. Thank you for being here. To apply varnish on all your paintings, it's uh, Kilman. Yes, sir. I um, But uh, if someone will buy it, uh, I will apply it, actually. Or someone uh, need it. Uh, sometimes I need to. But most of my paintings on my rooms, I uh, didn't put any varnish. 
but if I need to if something is uh, for example if I need to I need to to dispose it or give it away or something like uh, someone will buy it uh, I have to put some varnish varnish will help uh, colors will will uh, will make it I don't know uh, what you call I don't know what you call that it will become much more the color will come out I don't know uh, how you explain this one but uh, you can see the colors better when there's a varnish so I like it also so I am mixing now for a little uh, mix uh, mixtures of red yellow and a little blue and same thing I'm using this brush uh, that by using the tapping technique a uh, bit little by little there so I don't know everyone but it takes me a lot of time painting this <laughs> Oh, thank you, Siglin and Mace. Thank you so much for for giving me the sticker for the super chat. Thank you so much. Thank you. Uh, Bidhina, after this live tutorial, can you please upload this in step by step painting? Uh, I don't know. Maybe this is uh, already a uh, step by step. <laughs> uh, I have no. Actually, I didn't record the first part. That's the that's the wrong thing I did when I start this one. I forgot to record it with my camera and I just record the half part so I don't know maybe I don't know if I can put it on a good step by step thank you thank you Siglin Mace thank you so much thank you for the sticker once again So here we can just do the topping technique. So as you can see, everyone, my color is a little orange because of the leaves. Uh, it's a little different, but I can do the topping technique. Uh, yeah, it's a little bit different, my, but it's fine. I changed a bit my tree here. Actually, uh, I will not delete this after the live, so it will be a full tutorial. Actually, this is a tutorial. <laughs> Sorry about. I don't know, everyone. Maybe I will try to. Yeah, this is a big problem now. I'll try some brownish, yeah, and yellow. I'll put more leaves here. Maria de Fatima Rodriguez Gomez, John, how can we buy one of your work? Uh, actually, I am making uh, my own store, so maybe later I will uh, display everything there. You can buy it there. Thank you for asking. <laughs> actually, uh, some of my work will be for sale. there yeah I'm a bit uh, I'm a bit uh, really slow here everyone so just do the topping technique until here yeah I changed a bit the the, the leaves everyone the tree Thank you, Bidhi Nair. Thank you for painting uh, my works. Thank you for uh, painting 30 or 40 of my works. Thank you so much. Okay, now I'm going to put the highlights. So I'm, I'm a bit excited with the highlights. So the same brush everyone, since uh, this tree is very very small, I need to do it uh, little by little and small. And slowly, I mean. Mm. 
there. Okay. So I need it to be a bit orange. Hello, Bid Hina Air. Thank you so much. Sang Sang San One Two Three. I love I love your tutorials and have learned so much from watching so many of them. Thank you so much. May God continue. God bless you to also. Hi, it's Galman. It's Galman. Do you ship worldwide? Yeah, I can ship. Actually, sir, I, 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 I've been shipping paintings even before. And yeah, I can ship anywhere. If uh, shipping, uh, they can do it. Yeah, I think I can. And I've been shipping to US, to Canada, to Israel, and some other countries also. So yeah, I can ship. Once again, see Lindy Mays. Thank you so much for, for the sticker. Thank you very much. Yeah. Thank you for your kindness. So here everyone, I need to do it a little slowly. Sorry if uh, this will take a lot of time. Maybe I will just release the time lapse version of this one. I'm not sure if I can release again the the full tutorial. I need to buy another camera everyone for my palette because it's not really good. Uh, camera so I have to buy another one thank you on the name Salvi Lacoste thank you so much uh, you hear me I hear you I cannot read your name sorry horror fan I love your work and your work is beautiful thank you and Bianca Maxim you're doing also beautiful. thank you so much Amy Art and Craft Maming Salamat for the two euro, Siglindi Mace for the two dollars, thank you so much. Another Siglindi Mace for three dollars, thank you so much. I really appreciate your your donation. Okay, so uh, this time everyone, I need to make it smaller. I want to make it better, especially this one. So I will try to create, uh, to put some smaller uh, details or for the lips. So. I'll be using as a number one. I think this is a number one. And zero liner brush. Yeah, I can do it better. This one. And I'm gonna put some white and yellow. Yeah, I'll just do it a little slowly here, one by one, to create the uh, textures. Priscilla, Benedicto Sheldon, kuya, visit ka naman sa channel namin, sis, nanay. Sure, uh, tingnan ko mamaya, pagkatapos nito. So, maraming salamat sa iyo. Yeah, tingnan ko mamaya. Salamat. Maraming salamat for the invitation po. Uh, Bianca Maxim, I'm sorry, uh, you're, you're, I think you're, your message is hidden. Uh, I think the YouTube hide your message. I don't know why. Maybe of your link. Uh, yeah, it's not allowed to put the link there. I'll try to visit later. Okay, so just do them some dots. It will actually look like a leaves there in the far. I will put more highlights here on the sleeves. Yeah, this brush, uh, sh please show the brush type, Gabriel Garcia Salinas. Actually, this is uh, uh, a liner brush or a round brush, zero. So it's a small, small size flat brush, a uh, round brush, I mean, sorry. I'm 
putting some bushes here yeah adding some bushes okay so maybe i will try to use a bit a smaller brush Hello Rosely, maraming salamat. Yeah, maraming salamat sa inyo. Kaya kayo ni Nanay Nawaray Art, maraming salamat. Uh, please leave your comments. Uh, yeah, I'm reading your comments. Si Glendy Mays, thank you so much. You're most welcome. You are giving us your time and sharing techniques. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, wait. Uh, yeah. Thank you. Okay, so yeah, I'm, I'm putting now more uh, details on the. I am using now this uh, flat brush number two. It's the smallest flat brush I have. It's good for the leaves also. So yeah, I'm putting over here. To create those beautiful uh, smaller bushes. there and now i'm gonna use more orange i'll try to put some this type grassland there okay and also here I am now adding some grassland, everyone, or grasses. Uh, this, I'm using a uh, little yellowish with a little yellow or red, something like that. There. Iqbal, ba, Iqbal and Sarvi, Mr. Rizona, you are an excellent painter. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. And a great human being. Thank you so much. Your tutorials teach rather than hide portions of painting. And with night thirty. Thank you so much. Thank you for being here. I've learned so much from watching you. My own paintings has improved. Horror fan. Thank you so much. It's a uh, career. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Thank you for for being here. Yeah. Yeah, it's getting better now. Actually, I can see. I can see now. Uh, it's getting better. And I'm a little happy now. And um, I'm painting now for one hour. Actually, everyone, uh, I'm very, very slow with the life. I don't know if I can do it again. <laughs> Hopefully, I can. Okay, so here I will try to add more. A little brownish. Or darker greenish, something like that. So you can just mix the, some brownies, everyone, with the, uh, I don't know if you can see, yeah, you cannot see, so I'm going to move a little bit, or making my uh, view a little bigger, yeah, it's getting better now, so I'll just take the view here. Okay, I hope that you can see clearly. I'm going to move a bit. There. Okay, uh, I think I'm going to try now the. I'm going to move now to. To paint the. The. The mountain. Or this barn. I don't know what to call this one. So I'm, I'm going to do it now because it's one hour to seven minutes, everyone. I think this is the uh, the most uh, uh, I finish very very slow. Maybe because it's live. Landa, Klassen, wow, just impression. Love watching how you work. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Landa, Nandini, I learned painting from basic only because of you. Thank you so much. 
So you're the best, Nandini. Thank you. Christine Kier from Canada, thank you so much. Timothy, you got the body. You got this body. Good work. Thank you so much, Timothy. Anit Imbos, good morning, John. Love your paintings and your fantastic teaching. God bless you, sincerely, Anit, Queensland, Australia. Thank you, Anit. Thank you so much. It's Alicia. Thank you. Welcome here. Hacker Boy, thank you. Nihalal, thank you. Nishara, Hachara, thank you. Thank you for being here. Okay, so we call a get getacho. Welcome here. Bianca Maxim, John, I have done your works. Thank you so much, ma'am. Thank you, Bianca. Okay, so I'm going to mix now blue and the red. So this is my black, everyone. I didn't use any black. Just blue and the red. It's a uh, purple actually, uh, darker purple or something like that. So I'm putting now the, I'm adding now the, the roof. I'm not sure if my perspective or proportion is good, but I'll just try. Yeah, I'll just make this part dark. And then here. I'll try to readjust. Okay, so I'm sketching again. <laughs> so I'm, I'm trying to sketch again everyone uh, so that I will not lose what I was doing. Ricardo Alves, welcome here. Elizabeth, Elizabeth, hello. <laughs> hello dear. Okay, so here. I'm making this part dark because this part will be the will be the tree. Yeah, I like this big neighbor because of the big tree. It's covering the entire house. May G. Castor, Hospano, man, wait, ang ako What do you mean, po? Wait, this is live. Yeah, this is live, Catherine. Sir, how do you clean your painting palette? Actually, uh, I'm using my painting palette is uh, made. This is a uh, glass, and it is very easy to clean this one. You just have to put water, and mm, it will just clean. Uh, water and you can scratch it with the palette knife and it will be clean. So it's just easy with this uh, using the if you're using the what do you call this? Uh, if you're using the glass palette. Okay. It's a little exciting, everyone. I'm actually excited with the result. Uh, I don't even know what will uh, it look like. What it will look like after this one. 
Okay, so I'm adding some browns. Maybe I will do it. Do the roof first. Yeah, the roof is like uh, reddish brown. Yeah, something like that. So just red and uh, a little orange, maybe yellow. Yeah, red and the amber. There. To, I need to hold it good. I think something's wrong. It's not straight. Yeah, I need to that's this part everyone because uh, it's not straight <laughs> yeah, yeah okay so maybe later I have to put some yellow and then raw amber more raw amber yeah and then it's all white yeah this will be the color of the old wood not so much red maybe raw amber and the white Maria de Fatima Rodriguez, are you going through the second wave of COVID there? Uh, I'm not sure if we, I think we are not finished yet, finished, uh, yet with the first wave here. Uh, it's very hard in my place, but uh, thanks God that uh, my place here uh, where I live, uh, I have, we have, I think, zero case now. So, yeah, we are lucky uh, a little compared to other places. Uh, in the Philippines, so for now uh, we are like that, and it's a little safe here. Not just a little, but it's uh, safer here. Uh, MG Castor, sa blending ako nahirapan bagito pa lang ako. I'm using acrylic paint on canvas. Uh, just practice more. Catherine Winged, really nice so far. Thank you. Uh, Timikan, hello. Leandro Elias de Silva, thank you. Hello, Addison, good luck. Thank you. Nandini is, or my real name is Dan Street. Dan Street. So keep remind, remember, I will follow you. My second, you sure? Sure, yeah. Thank you. Dan Street. Floor, Figueroa. Hello, Catherine Winger. I don't mix media drawings for hours, but how do you have the patience? Actually, uh, I have also no patience, but I just have to keep on doing it. Darwin Alacon, hi Lisandra, good painting. Thank you, Darwin. Anything both warning when you are using a glass palette, make sure it is tempered glass. How you can enjoy by plain glass. You could cut your hands on the edges. Yeah, I think uh, actually the edge of my glass I tried to sand to sand to make it smooth. And yeah, it's safe now. It's much safer. Yeah, actually I'm aware of that on that also. It's uh, it's dangerous actually. So I need to sand the, the edge to make it uh, safe, uh, safer. So here. I will now try to put some browns. Uh, first comic, will you upload this? My favorite artist is Filipino like me. Thank you for your teaching. Thank you so much. Actually, I will not uh, delete this one. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, the, the, my problem is uh, I didn't record the first part of this one. I forgot to record to to hit the record button when I start the live stream. So I have no. Uh, I don't know how to get this one. Maybe I will download this again, or I don't know. Uh, I'm sorry about that. Uh, it was uh, it was a mess. Uh, this is my first time, so hopefully. Uh, yeah, and I cannot recover. I cannot change what. <laughs> Maybe I will just repaint this one or something like that. Or do it, doing it again. But it takes a lot of time again. <laughs> so.
So maybe I will just upload like this. Uh, I will not. Uh, I will not. Uh, I will not delete this one. Okay, so here I'm gonna put some darks. So there's a tree here uh, near, near, in the front. I think in the back of the house, everyone. This is the back of the house, ha back of the Nipa house. Something like that. There. Maria de Fatima, thanks, John. We are in the Red Montreal. Your Chuzola has been good since. Thank you so much. Thank you, Maria, for coming and painting with you. Even though I have online class later at 6 a.m. Thank you. But you should sleep uh, for coming. And I think boss, I bought a mulling flat glass for my palette. Oh, I think that will be good. Uh, one half cup. Thank you for your wonderful paintings that we enjoyed. And thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, I'm watching this instead of the glass. Uh, class, so yeah, I think you need to go to your class. Uh, Catherine, what do you do to avoid hard edges in the acrylic painting? Actually, um, you can you can blend it uh, good with a softer brush to avoid those uh, hard edges. But in in this acrylic landscape, uh, I don't I don't really care because uh, I just I just paint it uh, the way I see. And actually, uh, I. Sometimes I, I avoid those hard edges because uh, I use a brush. I, I when I when I make the edges, I try to soften it first before uh, when it's wet. I try to soft to make it soft before trying to to add the details. Yeah. Okay, so I think that's uh, better now. Yeah, I don't know how to explain. I'm sorry, everyone. I'm sorry. Uh, Annette, uh, what's this? Uh, uh, Emil Tariq, thank you so much. Katrin Wangard, I mean, finish everything. So, yeah, sure. Uh, here, I will try to use the raw umber and the white. Thank you everyone, I have 7,000 views now, so thank you for watching. And currently I have 177 watch, thank you. So here I will try to put some uh, details using, I am using now the number two nylon flat brush, the smallest flat brush I have. There. here I'm going to make it darker and blending blending it with the lighter colors there and also I will use a lighter color uh, with a little yellow can see now it's getting better so here this is light purple everyone I'm going to use this one for the roof it's a metal roof
Spotty channel, you're an amazing artist. Thank you so much. Amil Tech, I'm a big fan of yours. Thank you. Amil, Amil Tariq. Uh, Maria Di Fatima Rodriguez, I just finished painting the couple watching the sun. Thank you. Thank you so much. Lots of get ready for painting. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, say for Rewell Company, good, a good night. I'm painting I like. I imagine what art doesn't come. So thank you so much. Thank you so much, sir. Oh, I don't know. Amil Tarik, uh, which is brush is this? I'm using a small brush. Uh, it's number two nylon flat brush. So it's a flat brush now I'm using. Okay, I have to blend it here on the edge. Yeah, just blend it there. Maybe later I can put great details or highlights there. And then I'm gonna use this one a little lighter. Uh, I think it's a lighter purple now. I'm going to put the highlights on the top of this roof. There. Yeah. Okay, so I need to put more lights later on. Okay. So, using the lighter uh, bluish color or purple, I think I'm going to correct something here. It's not good. <laughs> So here I'm going to correct something like that. It should be straight one, okay? And then some lighter browns. Yeah. Uh, just roll on burn white everyone create some lighter browns actually my my brush have uh, blue there so it looks like uh, purple okay and it involves to help John answer the questions when you want to get rid of the hard edges used to have brush for blending over the heart thank you Annette thank you for this one half cup, I can't wait to see the finished result. I love you, Pete. Thank you, one half cup. Summer, summer, beautiful scenery. Thank you, Flor Hoda. Thank you. Hi, hi, Flor Figuero, Figueroa. Santosi uh, Fujari. Hello, Maria Fatima. Do you, do you sometimes paint the background in acry acrylic to finish the rest in oil? Uh, yeah, sometimes when I want to finish faster my oil paints, I use the acrylics as the background uh, actually it's faster <laughs> like that when uh, you put there wonderful thank you thank you so much so everyone I cannot uh, I cannot uh, I cannot read uh, Arabic so yeah sorry about that yeah so far it looks good and it's been one hour and 47 minutes it takes a lot of time this one okay now I'm going to start adding a tinier details so I'm using a small brush it's the number one number zero liner brush or round brush it's better so I'm adding white to existing uh, yellow and the uh, umber So I'm going to make it light because it's bright there. There. Uh, 
and in the roof I need to make it a little purple with the blue but it should be brighter everyone almost look like white So when you're doing this one, it should have a perspective of what. Egypt, uh, yeah, hello from Egypt. Spotted chat, I'm missing, I'm missing. Amazing, talented work. Thank you. I am from the Philippines. Please say my name. I am big fan. Uh, Amil Tariq, thank you. Maria de Fatima Rodriguez, where did you learn Portuguese, John? I'm from Brazil, but living in Canada for uh, about 22 years. Actually, I didn't learn Portuguese. Uh, I don't know, uh, maybe it's just the same with my language. I speak Filipino also, and some words are like Spanish, I don't know, something like that. Uh, yeah, we've been uh, in the We've been colonized by the Spanish for 300 years, so I think our words are almost the same with the Spanish. There. I'm going to put a little details like that. Okay. I'm using now the small brush, everyone. I'll make it a little lighter. There. And more white. Yeah. Is a little glowing there. Where did you learn Portuguese? Ah, yeah. Iqbal, I'm sorry, Arabic chat us by Namud. He's suggesting you to put Arabic options too, as he likes your paintings and wants to learn from you. Thank you. Um, I will try to ask someone, actually, I, I, uh, someone will translate my works also so they can have another language also so you can read it in, maybe in Arabic. Thank you so much. Anderson Pimentel, hello from Brazil. Mayor Lopez from Brazil, thank you. Hello, welcome here. So here I'm gonna put a little light. Okay. Yeah, looks good now. Row umber here. And then I need to put, I'm gonna use the rumber. Yeah, I need to put some dark here. And I think I need to use some white, red, yellow. And then uh, rumber. I'm going to add some highlights here. From the roof, everyone. Just a little by little. Actually, I just I just uh, copy 
I didn't copy so much on the roof everyone I just do whatever I can to make it look like that but it's a little different uh, it will take a lot of time to to do better like this to do better than this but I'll just try to make it look uh, the same yeah maybe like that it will just look the same on the far Anit in both John is a wonderful person I have known him for eight years. thank you Anit uh, yeah, thank you so much for being here with me Scaring, loving, and great teacher and hard work. Thank you. Uh, Maria de Fatim, how do you decide on size of the canvas? Uh, size of the choice, canvas work. Actually, for my tutorial, I use small canvas because it's easier and faster to finish. Yeah. Hello from Jammu, India. Benim Dermato. Hello. Lucia, Crisis do Nascimento. Yeah, Boa Tarde. Hello. Hi. Yes, thank you for your Okay, thank you everyone. Pio Singh, thank you. Welcome here. I'm going to enlighten this part. Yeah. Yeah, it's still a lot of work everyone. And it's almost two hours now. You can also follow my follow my uh, Patreon page, everyone. I have plenty of uh, I have also other tutorials there, exclusive for the Patreon. You can also follow me there and also support me at the same time. Okay, I'm gonna put a little dark here. So here everyone, I'm going to do it a little slowly now. Uh, I think I will use uh, the flat brush here to create those details on the woods, on the, what do you call this, on the, on the wall. So you have here the white and the raw amber. Yeah. Just do it uh, up and down to create those uh, details, like a uh, green, something like that. You can also do it slowly and then to create those uh, the upward or downward strokes. You can use the liner brush for this one if it's hard for you to use this brush. Uh, this brush is so good. I'm a big fan of your work, Baja Mula. Hello. Anit in Bos. I'm, I'm in Queensland. So, hello, Anit. Thank you. Maria, I joined the Patreon. I got first painting of the month. Both by the River Bank. Painting it at the moment. Thank you, Maria. Thank you for, for, for supporting me. Thank you so much. For extending your support. Yeah, maybe so now I'm going to make my studio better. Yeah, hopefully. But I think it will come. But for now, I'm happy with my studio, even if it's so small. Okay, so here I will try to put more.
So I'm adding a dark green of colors here. Actually, I'm doing it very, very slow, everyone. I am slower compared to uh, not uh, doing it live. And when it's, when it's not live, I can cut some parts, but here I cannot cut. I need to do it uh, slowly. Lucia Colette, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, Annette. Thank you, Maria. Uh, Chandra Hasao, can you, can you, anyone tell me when this live stream started? Actually, it started uh, one hour and 50 minutes ago. Actually, this is my first live stream and I just try to do it if my connection is good. But I, for now, my connection is good and I like it. So we we'll come here. Uh, uh, Chandra has so we we'll come here. Harim Fatim, how can we share uh, our painting that we tried from history? You can you can post it on my YouTube uh, on my I mean on my Facebook page. You can post post it there. Tisambo, thank you. Just Gwen, please give me a shout out. Hello, just Gwen. Hello, Gwen. Welcome here. This is Stoltz, Educational Relaxing Times, Jan. Thank you, Mrs. Stoltz. You're welcome. You're welcome. Thank you. Okay, so I'm going to add a little darker here. Yeah, I'm adding now a little tinier details, everyone. Not just little but tiny. <laughs> it's uh, redundant. And I'm gonna add some white, a little lighter. I think that it will be good. I'm going to add more. So there's a log here, crossing, forming an X, something like that. Uh, but I'll cover it later, everyone, with the with the tree, or oh, with the yeah, with the plant. Here yeah, also. John, some other artists take longer than a good painting takes time to get right. Yes, you are right, really right on it. Uh, the more time you put on a painting, the better it will always become. So uh, it's okay if you, it takes a lot of time, it takes more than two hours, that's fine because um, it will actually uh, make, you can actually make better painting if you put a lot of time. Yes, I yet, uh, I'm going to save this one, don't worry. Uh, I will not delete this one. Even if this is very, very long tutorial. Merit me it. Have a nice day. I'm from Turkey. You are best attack with painting. Uh, thank you, Mehmet Yet. Thank you from Turkey. Hello from Pakistan. One or the is Hello. Okay, so I'm going to put now the three. Okay, 
okay so I'll be using uh, I think this brush or yeah maybe I'll try to use now a bristle flat brush yeah it's a number 10 bristle flat brush for this tree here so I have here the blue the red and the yellow yeah it's a it's a little reddish everyone this tree so I'm gonna put more red and then you can use the topping technique there So let's just the topping everyone, do it a little slowly. I need to put uh, more yellow. Hello, hello from Turkey. Hi. Hi, hello. Welcome to my uh, live stream. Welcome to my channel. I'm going to add yellow with a little blue. to put red because uh, I think the color is a little brownish or reddish this house is a bit smaller <laughs> yeah what I paint is a bit smaller so I think I have to retouch this one and then I'm gonna use a yellow for the highlights I think yellow is the perfect color Just do the topping technique and do it slowly everyone. Okay, so you have the, this beautiful tree. Where the Aziz? Thank you so much. Welcome here. Busy na here. You'll get Aziz. Thank you. God bless you. God bless you too. 
Ah, uh, Badjas Mula, Sir Clifty Mia shout out. Ah, uh, hello Badja Mula. Hello, hello. Sambil bang uh, sorry, hello. Where are you from? I'm from the Philippines. Me meet you yet? I want to see you in Turkey one day. I think I think I will see you one day. Uh, see stats. I hit like button for just thank you. This is my very first live stream. You can share also. <laughs> thank you. Uh, Chandra Sao, you're so sir, you're self learned artist. Yeah, I'm a self taught artist. Bu painting. Hi, Bidina Air. I'm from UA. Hello, Bidina Air. Please visit here also. How shy, Maria Di Fatina. Yes, Jan. Think about the project and still life or how to paint the mystic animal farm like chicken or goose. Yeah, I will try that. So, Hunter of Art. Hello, from Basil. Maria Di Fatima, could you do a tutorial on how to paint with fox in a bank or snow? Yeah, maybe I will try to. Thank you for suggesting. Aurora Solvi, hello from Croatia. Hello, Aurora Solvi from Croatia. Another wonderful, wonderful video. Thank you. Uh, Nihar City, bye bye. Okay, yeah. I think uh, my three days are a bit smaller, but uh, it's still good. It's still good. And everything uh, went well. Okay, so yeah, I'm going to put some dark also, dark again, on the back of the, because there's another tree here. I think this is the same tree with the other tree. There, I'm going to use some yellow for the highlights. Here's the topic, uh, I mean, topping technique, everyone. There. Yeah, I think that's enough. I'm going to put more highlights for my three there. Just put my highlights, everyone. Okay. Yeah, I think that's a beautiful tree. It looks simple tree there. I like it. I like it. Okay, so I'm going to add more details on this part. So I'm going to use again the blue and the red. Yeah, for some dark. I thought this is my black, everyone, blue and the red. I don't use any black. I'm gonna adjust something. There. And then, uh, umber and white. Here, I'm gonna try to make it lighter. It's the side of the house, everyone. So, I'll just make it lighter. And then it little. And here I'll try to put something uh, tiny details. Also here. Yeah, it will be like that everyone. Yeah, looks good. Bo painting, most people here have YouTube channel about painting. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Terence Ferreira, fantastic painting with good description. Thank you, Terence Maria. 
to self taught artist how do you improve your technique do you do a lot of reading watch other videos actually uh, for now I'm, I'm I keep on practicing uh, I practice I paint every day I paint before uh, before I, ha I, I, I had YouTube uh, I try to practice myself I paint almost every day uh, that will help that will help me uh, improve so now I'm just uh, trying to do more uh, because of YouTube I can share everything so yeah but you need to keep on practicing always keep on painting that's very important because even if you just uh, watching is not enough so you need to practice do it yourself that's how you improve so here I will try to put darker grasses now so I am now putting the grasses I'm using now the bristle flat brush I hope you can see it yeah you can see I am putting now some grasses on the ground you can use the uh, if you have the if you have the fan brush everyone you can also use that thank you Nixon Cleville Fajia Pubi sir your painting are really good thank you thank you so much Kula Gi Hulam Muhiuddin excellent painting thank you sir Artology thank you Majiak book Yes, listen to John. He knows you must be an artistic path. Enjoy the learning. Thank you. Thank you, Artology. Thank you so much. Uh, yeah, I'll put some more. I'll mix some more orange and white. So here, I'll try to put more grasses. So actually, I am almost done, everyone. <laughs> I am now on this part, so a little grasses on the back of the house or the side of the house. I mean, you can use the fan brush, everyone. But uh, for me, it's, uh, I think I better use this one. Uh, fan, my fan brush is bigger, so it's hard for me to use that. So I will try orange here. So I can see some orange grasses also. If you have the fat press, you can also use. I'm going to put some darker color here for some tree. Yeah, there's a tree here on the side. And I like this tree. Actually, I am learning on this painting, everyone. Especially the bushes. I also learn. I can get something here. It's also good to to copy from photos because you are also learning. Uh, maybe you didn't try that before, and you can try it now. So here, I will try to put some highlights of the grasses. Just to make it look like an abstract, everyone, and it will look, will look good in the far. There. Maria, thanks John. If you ever in Canada or Brazil, you are most welcome. I'm leaving now, but keeping track of your work until next time. Thank you for your time, Maria. Thank you for time for being here. Actually, I'm almost done also. So, yeah, thank you so much. See you next time. Thank you so much, uh, uh, Maria. Uh, Marilsa Sarati Rossi, Ojimusana Brazil. Hello, Annette. Yes, Maria, I am self taught artist. Thank you. You're welcome. 
I told you everyone to be an artist like you. You can, actually everyone can be an artist. Uh, you just have to keep on practicing. Uh, if, it is, if, it, if you like to be an artist, then you need to start painting now. Because that's the only thing you can do is practice. It's not, it's not impossible also. So here I need to do also some uh, tapping technique. Let's tap it uh, to make it look, uh, there's a lot there. There's a lot of grasses there. It will look awfully busy. Okay. Uh, you can do like that to your brush. Thanks everyone I'm leaving. Uh, take care Maria de Fatima Rodriguez. Take, take care and thank you for being here. Uh, German Savitsky, uh, you have a very simple picture that helped me a lot in art school. Thank you German. Uh, Savitsky, Spanish Ch Chiroka, thank you for the live tutorial. You're welcome. Which type of brush you normally use? Actually, I just use five types of brushes, and this one is a bristle flat brush. I have also um, a nylon flat brush, uh, which is soft, softer than this one, and this one is a little uh, stiff or hard. But I like uh, this one for the grasses, so yeah, I can help a lot. So just keep on tapping everyone and then everything will keep in will turn and will fall into uh, good. Yeah. And it looks pretty good now everyone. It's very realistic and I really like it. Yeah. Actually it's very good to do also live stream. Uh, I don't want to hurry from time to time. Okay, it's 2.30 a.m. now here in my place in the Philippines, so uh, I'm doing it so late, but thank you everyone for, for being here. Okay, I have here a little lighter greens, I'm going to, uh, but, uh, sorry, it's wet. I'm going to add some yellow. I'm going to put some leaves here. So just the tapping everyone. Let's do it a little slowly and with a tapping technique to create those beautiful leaves. I'm using now the small flat brush number two. Yeah, I'm using, um, I'm trying to put some browns here, a red, red color. Okay, and it is uh, 
uh, what's that? 3 uh, three a.m. in Queensland, Australia. Thank you very much. Uh, John, many blessings to you and your family. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, uh, uh, Annette, for being here. I'm in 40 a.m. Oh, it's 40 a.m. In, in Australia. Oh, it's very late there. <laughs> Uh, bid he na air a practice on daily basis, especially from your tutorials, whether it can become a Yeah, you can. You can actually become. Just keep on practicing and painting. That's all you need to do. So we have here yellow with a bit of uh, blue and red. Yeah. And then white. Yeah, I'm using this one. Again, the same brush. And I will try to put some. plants with bigger leaves here there I like these plants everyone so you need to use a very bright color There and do it slowly to not hurry in doing this one because this is a uh, I'm doing the lips one by one. So it's kind of complicated because my place is very, very small here. There, okay. So this uh, this leaves about a bit bigger. Uh, also, this is near from us. Thank you, Annette. Thank you so much for that. Ivana, to make hello. Are you using wet brush? Yeah, I'm using. I'm using wet brush now. Bidhi na air. Thank you, Jan. Uh, you're welcome, Bidhi. Uh, Gabila Am. Thank you so much. I'm putting here more. Okay. Uh, the paint should be thick, everyone. Especially in this part. Yeah, I'm doing it slowly. Uh, it should be slowly for this part. Okay, I need to use darker also. This time I'm out of darker. Blue, red, and the yellow. Nah, this time it will be darker. There are some uh, woods there, but I'll just do like that. I'm gonna put more blue and red to make it darker. Ivan Atomic, hello, are you using wet? Yeah. Arguably, um, thank you so much.
Okay, so I, make, uh, I need to make it a little lighter, brighter. Thank you, Jadra Sibinek. Thank you so much. So I need to make this one thicker, everyone. So I'm using thick yellow paints for this part. There. And now I'm using this small brush uh, to create some uh, branches and, and trunk. So here I have the blue and the white. to create some smaller branches there this time takes to do electric painting is nothing compared to oil paintings which take four months to complete yeah um, yeah I think you know, you're right on it okay so I need to let you see the entire view doing a great job today Sorry. I'm very excited to let you see the entire view, everyone. Okay. I think it was, it is really, really good. Yeah. Actually, I'm very happy, everyone. It's not so close to the i think it's a little different my work is a lot greenish than the reference but i think it, it is good uh, it's also good <laughs> for me it's good uh, it's not always the same you know, but uh, i like uh, what i did today it's so wonderful okay so i'll just retouch everyone and i think i am done i'll just retouch some parts there and i think i will finish thank you always colette uh, Christine Kerr, thank you. Speak with you, Capis Pusini. Thank you so much. Anna, thank you. Uh, Lifeboard art, I will be posting it in all paintings soon. Would you like to watch? Yeah, yeah. You can, you can post on your channel. Uh, everyone can watch. Uh, I'm going to put something uh, white here and uh, amber. I'll just try to retouch everyone. Especially here. In the roof everyone I'm going to retouch. Maybe I have to make it a brighter there. And they are, hi John, do you do more of acrylic than oil? Actually, for now, because of my channel, I do a lot of acrylic. But before, uh, oil is really my favorite. Even now, still my favorite medium. So if I have commission work, I always do it in, in oils. So here we are, I'm going to make it brighter. The roof. Just do like that. Okay. 
and then also here I'll try to make it uh, life for art I'm new a uh, YouTube I'm new a uh, you new youtuber just dealing with the brand of subscribers oh yeah that's good Rosemary Castro, congrats from us. Thank you, Rosemary. Uh, do you sign and it embossed? Do you sign your uh, paintings? Yeah, I'm, I'm signing my paintings always. Yeah, I'm signing it in the in the in the bottom part. It's very important. Casbid, uh, love it. Uh, thank you, Casbid. Uh, I say to myself, thank you so much. Aurora Selvi, thank you so much. Actually, I'm almost done. Everyone, Jisambo, thank you. Thank you for being here. Yeah, I think uh, I am good with this. Uh, wait, I have to put something. <laughs> Maybe I forget. Uh, just a little to the back part. Uh, yeah, it's not so important, everyone. But uh, I'm going to put it here. Uh, maybe some small forest in the back. Okay. Yeah, that's not so important. <laughs> okay, so yeah, more retouch everyone and it will become much more beautiful. But for now, uh, I think I am contented with the entire result. Yeah, for me, this is really, really good. I like it. So yeah, I think I, I will be finishing this work now. Annette in Boss, I will see you next time on your YouTube. Yeah, thank you, Annette. Thank you so much. I will be posting more. Thank you, Swap Neil, Swami, great painting, sir. Thank you, Swap Neil. Thank you so much. And I think I am done, everyone. I think uh, I am good with this. And for two hours and 35 minutes, I finished the entire work. <laughs> and I want to say thank you for, for all of you who are here. Thank you for watching me. Thank you for watching my video. Thank you for, not me everyone, but my painting. Thank you for watching my painting. And I'm really, really happy that you are here. This is my very first tutorial, uh, a live tutorial. Rusil Benito Sheldon, thank you, Kuya. Uh, maraming salamat, uh, Rusil Benito Sheldon. Maraming salamat. Life for Art, you guys are my inspiration. Thank you, Life for Art, Mimi Art and Crafts. Thank you, maraming salamat. Chadra Sibirak, have a nice day. Have a nice day to you, Chadra Sibirak. Uh, Anit M. Boyle, boss, what oil paints to use? I'm using the... Here I have... I'm using um, the Windsor oil paint. This is a toy, uh, an oil paint, everyone. Uh, this is an oil paint, uh, Anit. I'm using this one. Uh, this is actually a uh, uh, student grade, grade acrylics. Uh, no, sorry student grid oil paints it's much cheaper uh, in my country and I'm using this one because it's cheap brand and uh, there's also um, there's also um, an artist grade but I'm not using it uh, so far I'm, still, I'm using the student grades uh, thank you for the stream thank you so much it's our pleasure to witness such a great painting. So, Niels, thank you. Ibanatomic, great artwork. Thank you for your. Thank you, Ibanatomic, colorful ink pad. So nice. Thank you. Thank you, colorful ink pad. Amy, art and craft. Thank you so much. Yeah, I think uh, I'm good to go, everyone. So, until here, I want to say thank you for everything. Annette in Boss School, that's what I used to. And Georgian oil paints. Yeah, I never, I don't know if we can find it here in my place, Georgian oil paints, but I'll try. I never tried this brand, but I think that's a good brand. Chinibi Balsote, salamat sa gusto ko, mga paintings po, mabuti, wala kami work, napanood kayo, God bless. Uh, maraming salamat din, Chinibi Balsote, for, uh, sa pagpanood, uh, panood, uh, ngayong uh, first live ko, at sa mga tutorials ko, maraming salamat. And uh, I think I am done now. Yeah, it's been 2 hours and 38 minutes. So, yeah, everyone. Uh, once again, thank you for watching. I'm very, very happy with the entire result. Uh, it's my very first time and 
it was really really great first time for me so yeah maybe later also soon i'll have another live stream yeah please support me hopefully in the future everyone and okay so okay so you can also follow me on my facebook uh, page team listen the arts on my twitter Archuma. you can also follow me on my uh, on my instagram artjumalis on my pinterest jimlison and minimore so once again everyone thank you so much uh, Amy Art and Craft, idol sana, upload mo to. Actually, uh, hindi ko to i-delete. Actually, I'll just leave it in the YouTube. So, um, I would not, uh, I think this is a uh, entire tutorial already. And I think when I finish my next painting, I will send you to, to you of Jesus coming. Oh, thank you, thank you, Annette and Boss. I'm really happy to see this, to see your work. Call of Ethan, from what age you start painting, sir? Um, I'm starting at the age of, um, uh, I think I was 14 years old. It was the year 2000. I was 14 that time. So I am painting now for, I think, uh, 20 years. Uh, okay, beautiful details like always. Thank you. Nanay Nawaray Art. So preganda kabayan. Marami salamat po, Nanay Nawaray Art. Thank you so much. Okay, so I think until here, I'll be finishing this work and see you next time. See you next time, everyone. And, and all I, I want to say to you is just keep on practicing, keep on painting. The more you do it, the more you know how to use your brush, the more you know how to mix the colors. That's why I'm always using limited colors. It's very important to use these limited colors because you can learn more. Thank you, have a nice day and God bless you all. All the glory, honor, praises, thanksgiving, adoration, and power belongs to the Lord.